uh, real quick, you got a collaboration that um, you told me about. Mm-hmm. But you know, I heard it, but we ain't we ain't really get a chance to talk about okay. in depth. Was the um, three stacks Andre three thousand on Sorry? Yeah. <sighs> it was cold, wasn't it? Man. Ooh, real cold demonstration. How long it take you to get that verse from him? Good God Almighty! I'm talking <laughs> about man. We were back and forth about that man ever since the King album. Number was 2006, 2007, man. Woo! I'm talking about it was a long time ago, man. Long time ago, but it was worth the wait. Damn. Still Sister, worth the wait. It was worth the wait. It was right? worth the wait. All right. word week. So here's the thing, man. Um, usually when people got a record that great, they shoot a video for it. You know, and I'm talking to him about that. Okay. But uh. we, but, but you know, Andre, 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 uh, he, 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 he told me when he did it that he can't guarantee getting in no video. You know, nothing, nothing, nothing about that. So, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 if, if the people out there, if y'all, you know, can convince Andre just as much as I've tried mm-hmm. and everyone else has tried, y'all want to see it as much as I want to see it. Then, you know what I'm saying, y'all find Andre. And this ain't hard to do. Mm-hmm. Well, it is hard to do. It's not easy to do. Convincing him or finding him. It's not easy to do. <laughs> so, But I invite you guys to, <laughs> won't you show your heart and, and bear your soul mm-hmm. on camera, online somewhere where he can go see it. And we'll do a viral online petition <laughs> and see if we can't come up with something. And I even said, I, I was, you know what I'm saying, just thinking, trying to be creative. I was like, you know, how about if we didn't do a video, what if we did a short film? Okay. We didn't even have to perform to the camera. We could just act out the lyrics. Mm -hmm. And we can actually get, you know what I'm saying, a real movie, a cinematic director to really just bring that thing to life, full circle. full circle, And, you know, he entertained that idea for about high, five hot minutes. <laughs> and then he said, you know what, you know what, young bro, I'm going to get back with you. I'm going to think on that and I'm going to talk back to you. <laughs> Is that how he did so it? So we just going to continue to, you know what I'm saying, connect. And, and whether we do the video or not, I just appreciate him just, you know what I'm saying, turning up on my album, man. Mm-hmm. You know, if, if if he decided to never shoot a video, never do nothing, I still appreciate it. Just, you know, just the affiliation is... You know, that's that's one to check off my list. Yeah, man. Uh, that's a great song. And I, I found it curious, like, we all got our way that we do the highs, and we, we, we nicely tell you nah. But, <laughs> was that his? Like, uh, I don't know. Well, I'm going to think on it for a minute. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, okay. I think that just him just thinking, you know what I'm saying, just making sure that before he agree to do something, that mm-hmm. it's really something that he can actually carry out. You know, mm-hmm. he don't want to obligate himself to something that he just, you know, physically just can't, can't see do. himself doing. Which uh, is understandable. Let me ask you a question about the album cover. First thing I notice is, it, well, first of all, it feels like a vintage feel to me, the way yeah. the artwork is. Yeah. Um, uh, but you're holding a gun on the cover. A metaphorical. Okay, speak a on A metaphorical. That. Yeah. Okay. Uh, a, a, a creative, conceptual gun that represents yeah. all of the things in life that can get a man in trouble in the form of what one could consider a gun. Mm-hmm. However, not a real gun. And that was not even a real pose. That was an illustration. So okay. if it was a real gun, that would have just been a real gun that they drew in the hand of someone that looks very similar to T.I. Mm-hmm. But it was a drawing. Mm-hmm. Okay, there was not a gun being held in any photo shoot in anywhere, and I want everybody to make sure that they know that and get that very, very clear and understood, okay? That wasn't a real gun. It was not a real gun. It was a metaphorical, metaphorical. conceptual okay. gun. It was, you know what I'm saying, all the things balled up that could get anybody in trouble balled up, and, you know, and it formed the shape of what one <laughs> would consider yeah, that, a gun. There it is, man. That was brilliant. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the way you explained that was I brilliant. I appreciate that. Okay. Thank you so very much. Absolutely. Uh, all right, T.I. is here. This is Grand Hustle Takeover, man. Yeah, yeah. Let's start taking it over. Uh, Let's do it. Number one, uh, well, we got, well, I'll wait till a couple more people get on the couch, okay, man. Okay, cool, but, man. Let's do but that. But one of the members. Well, uh, one of them, but you, we got a couple people, but you got to you need some more couch, couch here for yeah, some of these people, man. You're going to need a little more couch. You got big country now. That's the last show here. Yeah, big country. Yeah, big country. We got yeah, big country. country. We got trade We're going to need a little more couch, man. All right. We'll figure it out with big country, man.